When you're a very old lady, breathing your last breath, wondering where it all went wrong. Today, today is where it all went wrong. Say that again and I'll try and keep a straight face. <laughs> Was it the venue? It's the only place I could get at such short notice. Do you really want to do this now? Look, you should be a Rona. You should have divorced me the second your probation finished. That was your first mistake. How can you talk divorce on our anniversary? Have you no heart? Our agreement is over. It's done. Now, I want half of everything, and I mean everything. Things you didn't even know you own. Andrea, I think Graham may have stopped taking his medication. I'll fight you all the way. And I uh, like a fight. <laughs> Even one you could never win. This is ridiculous. You've served your purpose, Graham. And it was fun. But I was always going to get bored of that brooding little butler thing. Now, what you need to do is take the money we agreed, say thank you, and run along with your tail between your legs and live drunkenly unhappy ever after with your drug addict vet and her child. <laughs> What a lovely little tragic family. Flesh and blood. Hmm. Means so much to you now, doesn't it, Kim? Graham. You want tragic? How about... The rich old lady, not knowing her precious little granddaughter, isn't really her own flesh and blood. That's... I know what you're doing. You really think I'm going to bite? Yes, because the seed's been planted. Oh, I'm sorry. I should have chosen my words a little more carefully. Oh, this is not going to solve anything. No, but it's not about damage limitation now. Of course she's my granddaughter. And if we have to do a test to prove it... Your poor stupid Sonny doesn't know either, but now you do. Liar! And you'd grown so close to her, hadn't you? But Millie isn't Jamie's daughter. She's mine. The apple of my eye. 